During their busiest week of the year, Pamela's Diner here in Oakland is closed for the second day in the row. And owners tell me it's beginning to become a major problem. It's happened to us more than once, more than twice, more than three times. And Tim Blossett says he's had enough. He's one of the owners of Pamela's Diner in Oakland, and he says he's had to close the restaurant due to no power nearly seven or eight times. But he's not quite sure why. Blossett telling Pittsburgh's Action News 4 that the diner has never been able to get a clear answer from the power company Duquesne Light. He says the repeated closures have cost his business thousands upon thousands of dollars, not only in lost product, but also in lost sales. This most recent power failure started Saturday and was really a gut punch to Blossett and his entire staff. My heart breaks, you know, you know, how do, how do I, you know, recover their income, my income, you know, and, you know, I, the community. You know, as well, I mean, you know, they come to expect us being here and, you know, we're sad that we're not here for them. We've reached out to Duquesne Light to try and get some answers. At this point, they tell us they're looking into the problem. In the meantime, the lights are back on at the Oakland location, but Blossett had already told his staff to not come in. So they're out of another day of sales. And the plan is to be back open tomorrow. Reporting from Oakland, I'm Lily Coleman for Pittsburgh's Action News 4.